Hey, what's up guys? It is me, Chachi Onyx. I am here with another video. I have made multiple takes for this video and I was cool with one. It was 14, 15 minutes, but I made a mistake and then I just had some mental lapses in two other takes. So this is basically my fourth take of this video. Normally I do it in one, but, and it kind of annoys me a little bit, but it's okay. So to, I'm making this video for UFC Fight Night, Calvin Cater versus Josh Emmett. This fight takes place in the featherweight division. It'll be a featherweight bout at 145 pounds um, between number four, Calvin Cater, and number seven, Josh Emmett. Um, before I give the overview and before I delve into the details um, a little bit, I guess, about tomorrow's fights, I do want to say that I went six and five last week, including getting the main event right with Yuri Prohaska. So let's talk about this weekend's fights, which will be tomorrow. I'm currently making this video the night before. It is 10.35 p.m. June 17th. Tomorrow is June 18th. These fights will take place in Austin, Texas, in the Moody Center. Austin, Texas, United States, of course, whatever well, Austin, Texas is there. Um, so these fights will be on ESPN mainly. So the prelims will begin, at least for me, since I live on the West Coast, 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, and the main card, the prelims are on ESPN2 and ESPN+, Plus, and the main card will be at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on ESPN and ESPN+. Plus. So I'm just going to give the overview, and then I'm going to make my predictions, because I've basically already done this once, essentially fully once. So the overview of the fights... We have a, to kick things off, we have a middleweight bout at 185 pounds between Roman Delize and Kyle Dawkins. We then have another middleweight bout at 185 pounds between Phil Hawes and Darren Wynn. We then have a bantamweight bout between Eddie Wineland and Cody Stamen. We then have a women's strawweight bout at 115 pounds between Maria Oliveira and Gloria DePaula. We then have a featherweight bout at a, between Ricardo Ramos we have a featherweight bout at 145 pounds between Ricardo Ramos and Danny Chavez. We then have a welterweight bout at 170 pounds between Court McGee and Jeremiah Wells. We then have a women's flyweight bout at, 120, at 125 pounds between Jasmine Jazdavicius versus Natalia Silva. We then have a bantamweight bout at 135 pounds between Adrian Yanez and Tony Kelly. We then move to the main card. We have a middleweight bout to kick the main card off, we have a middleweight bout at 185 pounds between Julian Marquez and Gregory Rodriguez. We then have a lightweight bout at 115 pounds, 115 pounds between Demir Ismagulov and Guram Kutataladze. We then have a middleweight bout at 185 pounds between Joaquin Buckley and Albert Durayev. We then have a welterweight bout at 170 pounds between Tim Means and Kevin Holland. We then have a, a lightweight bout at 155. Did I say 115? I meant to say 155 for uh, Demir and Guram. That's 155, not 115. We then have a lightweight bout at 155 pounds between Donald Cerrone and Joe Lauzon. And then that's the co-main. And then the main event of the evening is a featherweight bout at 145 pounds between number four, Calvin Cater, and number seven, Josh Emmett. I guess the beauty in me messing up that first take is that this video is going to be a lot shorter because I already have my picks for these fights. So it's, it's less raw, whatever. Um, so the picks that I had made, and before I make my picks, there's one fighter who missed weight, and that is between the Adrian Yanez, it, it is be, and that is between the Bantamweight, and that is one of the fighters for the Bantamweight bout for Adrian Yanez and Tony Kelly. It was Tony Kelly who missed weight by a pound and a half, so he will forfeit 20% of his purse to Adrian Yanez. Let's just, let's just go with my picks to not waste time. I got Roman Delize over Cal Dawkins. I got Phil Haas over Dur Dur Duran Wynn, Darren Wynn. I got Cody Stamen over Eddie Wineland. I got Gloria DePaula over Maria Oliveira. I got Ricardo Ramos over Danny Chavez. I got Jeremiah Wells over Court McGee. I got Jasmine Jazdavicius over Natalia Silva. I got Adrian Yanez over Tony Kelly, not because he missed weight, but because I've seen him fight. Very great striker. I got Julian Marquez 
in the main event of the in the main card, I got Julian Marquez over Gregory Rodriguez. I got Demir Izmagulov over Garam Kutataladze. I got Albert Durayev, very familiar with him on Dana White's Contender Series, um, over Joaquin Buckley. I've seen Joaquin Buckley, great fighter, he's awesome, but I just think Albert Durayev is gonna punch his ticket uh, with a victory. I got Kevin Holland over Tim Means. I got Joe Lauzon over Donald Cerrone. And in the main event of the evening, I got Calvin Cater over Josh Emmett. And I'm picking Calvin Cater because what he did to Giga Chikadze in his last fight back in January, absolutely crazy, absolutely insane. To do that to a guy like Giga Chikadze, just impressive, very impressive. So Calvin Cater's my guy for tomorrow. I'll give an overview of the fights. Hopefully I don't make a mistake like I did to end the video. So um, for this take, so we'll see. <laughs> um, the overview of the fighters that I have picked, Roman Delizze, Phil Haas, Cody Stamen, Gloria De Paula, Ricardo Ramos, Jeremiah Wells, Jasmine Jazdavicius, Adrian Yanez, Julian Marquez, Demir Ismagulov, Albert Durayev, Kevin Holland, Joe Lauzon, and Calvin Cater. So this video is going to be a lot shorter by like, it's cut in half. It's cut in half. It's a less raw. I already have my picks uh, in mind. So um, I will say, if you guys are going to bet on any of the fighters that I am picking, make sure that you are confident enough in my picks. Make sure you are confident enough in who I have picked is going to win the fight. If you disagree with me, like for example, I've picked Calvin Cater over Josh Emmett. If you agree with me and you are confident enough that Calvin Cater is going to win the fight, great. But if you disagree with me and you believe that Josh Emmett is going to win, then make that pick. You can disagree with me, all good, no big deal, and pick Josh Emmett. Make sure you are confident enough in that who I have picked is going to win the fight. And if not, make the just just pick the other fighter. Um, so that is uh, pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is a shorter video compared to the first take. And I think that's better. So I don't waste any time here. Um, looking forward to seeing a great night of fights tomorrow. See some KOs, see some submissions, see some wars. If they go to, you know, just a great fight overall, whether regardless of how they end. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, I will say, I did mention the fighter who missed weight that had come to my mind right now. That was Tony Kelly. Um, that is pretty much it. And if you guys are watching the fights tomorrow, I hope you enjoyed the fights tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.